Greetings and welcome back to Clan Folk. I'm Catherine of Sky. I'm super, super excited about our progress. Oh, let me just check a thing. Yes, we have been recording for 11 seconds. Most excellent. So we have recently added uh, an addition to our home, which apparently I have put the walls in the wrong place. That is not ideal. Okay, let's move them along. Um, apparently I thought this constructed part was wall, but it is not. Uh, it's a road. Actually, you know what? Let's just move the road. That's easier, I think. Um, and we'll add a dirt path. It's fine for outside. They don't mind at all. So let's just do that. Alright, so we have a few things happening. We have plenty of beds for chickens. They seem to be quite content. Um, we don't have any lights. I'm actually afraid to put lights in because they all seem to be flammable. Let me just check that and see. Do we have... See crafting, storage, hunting. I don't know if we actually have any lights because um, I might not have researched any because we're we're really short on idea points. Last time we needed like nine to um, add the things that we wanted. So yeah, not ideal. Let's see what we have here. We can do a. Here's a wall torch. Um, does it? give us, I don't know if it gives us anything, but it does require fuel, I believe, to, to work out. Now, in the last uh, one, we needed sack to get clothing, um, and I think that related to animal beds in some way? Not animal beds, but animal food bowls. Uh, that seems to be a very big ask, honestly. So this needs the cat bed. Cat bed leads to food bowls, apparently, and cat beds are not derived from animal beds no 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 they are derived from clothing baskets which we know about so that's another unlock we need a sackcloth shirt and bottoms which is derived from the clothing table or clothing maker thingy zone here we go and then sack yeah sacks are from the clothing zone so that should automatically unlock as soon as we build one so yes, we are doing many things. Okay, we have this built, that's quite nice. I am going to go ahead and be neat and join the wall there because I feel that that's a good idea. Let's put a wattle wall there. And then I'm going to demolish these walls making one large room because we don't yet have the facility to make things like vents or curtains because all of those cost idea points and we're kind of short on them right now. Now I do want to clear the grass inside because that's kind of annoying. <laughs> and, uh, oh wait, can we actually do this? Let's let's turn off the harvest 100%. Uh, we just want to clear it. We don't care. And then we will also gather stones in here. Let's see, is there a gather everything? Um... No, not exactly. Let's just do the gather stones uh, command here. And that will be okay-ish. So we are gathering different things here. It looks like we might need to plant some more wheat. But I think we decided last time that, yeah, we can't plant it right now because you can only grow it in the spring and summer. Okay, that's just fine. That is just fine. So they're going to go ahead and harvest this. Probably won't get very much yield from this, if any. Oh, we got four from that. What is this? What are we making here? This is uh, flax. Okay, fine. Very fine. Um, we could actually mine this part of the mountain here, just so we get um, a little bit more space inside, which is going to be fine. Nice. Actually, let's get this one as well, and then we'll replace that wall with a different wall. Uh, so we have a nice square area. But we do have a door. Everything is nice inside. The inside temperature here is... Um, oh, that's out... How is this outside? Oh my god, we, ha oh, we, we have new problems. Okay, new problems are happening. It is fine. We will put a wall here. Like, super pronto. Yo. Uh, because what's happened is as we're mining these walls away, the, 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 the ceiling is falling in, which is not ideal. So let's go ahead and make this a hay roof over here. We can make it. This is enough to support this area. I kind of completely forgot about pillars again. Oh dear. But it'll be fine. We'll just put this on Znock and it will be great. Good. There we go. Um, looking good. Everything is looking fabulous right now. Good, good, good. 
now. We just gotta wait for those ice things to freeze into ice or... Oh, we have a, a person to visit us. Yeah, coming in. Here. I don't know if any of these people have paid us any money. I can't tell what how much money. Oh, here it is. We have 109. Well then, we have been paid. Excellent. I feel this is good. All right. Woohoo. Okay, so yay. This, we have holes in the ceiling. Good God, this is not great. Julie is not a happy man. What does he need? He needs water and sleep. Okay, we can fix that and fun. Maybe we should make more flutes. Uh, we'll see. Anyway, what did we get? We got a clothing zone. Ah, yes, we need to make this or place it somewhere. Um, where is a good question? Maybe here. Is this, this doesn't throw sparks, so I think it should be okay if we placed it like down here. And we'll put that also on Snox so they can get that done ASAP. 12x speed, go, go, go. I feel like night could pass faster. That would be kind of nice. I don't, I kind of want to make this room bigger, but I also don't want to make it bigger because um, the cooling in this room, actually, you know what we could do? We could just build walls in here. Let's build walls to make the room smaller and then dig into the room we don't care about. I think that's a good idea. However, it is annoyingly difficult to see inside this room. Like I can't, figure out how we can like this is annoying oh there we go let's do that and we'll put in a door here because we want to cool as small a place as possible otherwise we're going to run out of ice jugs and i think we might need to make more jugs let's go ahead and do that let's make 12 more there we go 12 more that's basically two pallets worth because pallet holds um six jugs we unlocked sacks. Perfect. So let's make a few sacks. We need... I'm, I'm liking this whole idea that you have to make a sack and then you make the clothing from sack cloth. Uh-huh. Why do you bother sewing up the sack if you're just going to make it into t-shirts, you know? I don't quite get it. Okay. This stuff is looking for water, which is interesting. But I don't know if it even grows in the fall because it says it doesn't grow. It says it's spring-summer crop, but does it grow? Or is it just you cannot plant it outside of spring and summer? I don't know. It's a bit confusing. Anyway, it's okay. We'll figure it out. So this is our grain area. We can also make a materials area for um, ingredients. Yeah, let's just do that for the sackcloth and all that kind of junk. Um, maybe we want to make it to only have sacks low. They're not in here. Oh dear. Okay, maybe this is the wrong uh, kind of stockpile. It might be. Um, let's see. Remove this, please. And maybe it's general? Maybe it's general that we need. Yep, seems like it. Okay, let's get sacks in here and we can also get clothing if we find them. I don't see any clothing, but maybe that's a different uh, stockpile. All right, we have another unlock in here, which is the sackcloth shirt. Let's make like f two... And as people pick them up and wear them, they're going to make more, right? So you don't need a huge pot stockpile of stuff unless you get a trader. And then you can trade some of the clothing with them. Now, speaking of, maybe we should get the idea tree and invite a trader along. Um, or maybe not. Trader, wow, three idea points? Hello? That's expensive. Um, so what we need now is we need to get the cat basket situation going on. I quite like that it's derived from a clothing basket. That's hilarious. Okay, so we need this. We need, we'll, we'll get it unlocked automatically as soon as they make shirts and, um, some shorts. So I think it's going to just come along quite nicely. Um, I really wish we could see inside here. This is quite weird to have to, like, um, kind of guess. It's so dang dark. You know, we could put a a window in the wall. Maybe that's what we do, is we put a window here. It's not a wall, so we're going to have to mine it. Mine the mountain, and then put in a wall and a window. I think that's what we do with that. In other uh, lands, then let's make this an area that we mine. And just kind of like, you know, mine around this area. Oh, good. Okay, that's perfect. So what we're going to do, we get a wall. Make an actual wall. Uh, quick, quick, and then put a window in the wall. That's what we want. So we can get some light in here. That's good. 
What what a wall. It's knock knock. All this knock happening all the time. Good. And in in getting this, we're gonna get some iron from the mountain as well. So we also got enough to get an iron ore pile. That's excellent. Is this our iron ore maker? No, that's the kiln. We have the bloomery out here. So this is where we should stockpile our um our iron. So let's get that going. We have oh we have the clothing basket. There we go. So the iron ore pile. This has low flammability, but not zero. So we don't want to make it maybe too close. Let's put it here. I think that's within the two tile radius, even though it's slightly diagonal. So let's see, stockpile, uh, no objects. We want to get our clothing basket next to the clothing maker. Um, is there anything else in here? No, basic needs though. We got a grave and a pet grave. Oh, how nice, wow. I didn't notice that you would have to have multiple, weird. All right, you know what? This is so pretty down here. We have all of these thistle patches. I think we can, let's dig a few graves here just to be proactive. That sounds quite dark, doesn't it? <laughs> but we do know people die. People die of old age and uh, then new people come of age to be workers. That's great, we like workers. Also, I think I'm gonna replace this stone with a a regular wall so we have light because having no light is a pain in the socks oh my god let's just do that then so we need to mine mountain here actually we'll get these two as well and then let's do this on knock and then replace it with a uh a wall a proper wall here come on folks let's go oh can i do that i don't think i can do that Maybe, naughty, I don't know, I can tell. I don't know if they'll do this. We'll see if they do the job. Anyway, um, looks everything looks pretty good. So let's look at our idea tree again. We don't have a job board. That could be fun to actually bring people in. We have iron ore, nice. Um, so uh, we got the cat clothing basket. Now the cat basket, where is that? Cat bed is two idea points. We need, oh, we have three. Okay, let's get that idea. We don't have a cat, alas, but you need this to unlock the pet food bowl. I don't get this at all. Like, why? Um, why didn't it come with the pet beds? Because you may not have a cat. You may just have chickens like I do. So this is very strange to me. Anyway, we have to make a cat bed. Um, but that's okay, because I, I envision having a cat at some point. Uh, probably not a herd of cats. Um, just, oh, it's in hunting. Nice. Uh, you know, they do, uh, cats do work and they do hunt the um, uh, rats that are around. So that's good. Okay, we got a little ding. Hey, hey, dude, come and rest here. It's fine. Okay, we got money from the other guy. We got 19 monies last time. Okay, this is great. We're getting this thing to have a, uh, a window. Hello, what was that? Another person? Sure, coming in. Let's -a go. Never had two yet before. Anyway, let's just knock this window. Um, so the idea with this here is that we could easily expand our freezer section as much as we want. We just need to get these. Um, actually, let's get this thing and exclude water jugs because I don't want them, them here. Um, we might need to actually improve the, uh, the size of this food storage zone. Uh, the stockpile because uh, we might have other food that we put in here but we actually have the food baskets which will hold everything so um, I'm not happy with our days of food left that is really low I want to see if we can maybe find more mushrooms let's see if we can get more mushrooms maybe they're they might not oh hello mushrooms hi how you doing yeah they're beautiful oh my god there's so many Whew, that's beautiful all right We'll let them do that tomorrow. They will pick mushrooms all day and all night tomorrow. And you know what? In Swedenland, it is all day and all night. We have sunrise at 3 o'clock in the morning and sunset around 11. So yeah, good luck getting enough sleep. <laughs> uh, at least for our little computer-generated people who wake at dawn. They have no choice now. Suffer onward. Okay. But um, looks like several people are absent from bed, which is causing us not to go at 12x speed. Come on, folks. We need to go past the night. You're not doing any work. I am the factory commander. Yes, I am not the supervisor or the administrator. I am the factory commander. Get used to it. 
Um, we are going to start really redesigning the entire home section soon. So don't worry, it does look like an absolute freaking mess right now. It's terrible, but that will be fixed. Um, I do want to just get through the first winter because um, in general, let's see, how, how warm is this in here? Um, what does it say? Please tell us. Oh, there it is. 67 degrees Fahrenheit, which is very livable. This room, on the other hand, is 44, which is excellent for food preservation. Uh, the lower the temperature is, the, the longer the food lasts. It does not have to be freezing in order for food to, like, completely stay good. Uh, well, it does have to, like, forever. But, like, if it's cooler, the food deteriorates uh, slo more slowly. So it's really important to, to get a freezer or a cooled room ASAP. Uh, all right, looks looking good. This is pretty great. So this, we want to exclude all of these, turn them off, and hopefully they'll carry them outside because outside these guys are going to freeze faster. So what I want to do is instead of having them all along the road like this, we can make pet food bowl and water bowls. That's good. Also, we need to get the drinking thingy for people so they can basically they defrost the water at their uh, local fire pit or um, uh, fireplace and I want to unlock that as well um, and then they do that uh, and then they can pour it in like a drinking fountain kind of situation that's what we really want because that's where they get stuff in the winter so let's see where would that be let's find out also, we might want to get hide processing stuff soon uh, because we want, oh, we need a tide, tile peat stove. Okay, we don't have that yet. Let's get the food bowls for the pets real quick uh, so that we build those and that unlocks other things. Inventory, no. Uh, hmm. Night, where is it? Objects. Probably under hunting, yeah, because apparently this is hunting. Don't know how that works. All right, let's put the food bowl here. Just rotate it that way. Water bowl here. Okay, fine. And let's get our objects going on here. Let's see, clothing, storage. Where? What am I? I don't even know what I'm looking for anymore. Um, crafting. No, we have everything there. I think we were going to look at ideas again because we needed something. Um, the hide stuff comes from the hide rack. We needed the stove, right? Yeah. We definitely needed the stove. There's an herb rack. I don't know if we need herbs for anything. Herbs or herbs, depending on your proclivities. Wow, the dog bed is a separate from everything else? Really? Dogs will sleep anywhere. You don't need to have their own dog bed. That's very silly. Um, okay, so we have thistle pad. Okay, da, 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 da. rat trap. Do we need that yet? I think if we get a cat, we don't need one. Torch. Mm, I'm kind of, s I don't know if I'm sold on the torch yet. The bog iron crusher is going to be necessary later, but I don't know if it's needed now. What I'm looking for is the peat fed stove. That is kind of important. And uh, I'm kind of just like looking for it. Like where the heck is it hiding here? But is it me? Oh, here it is. Four idea points. Uh, we just don't have enough yet. Okay, so that is near the Timbery Stone Fireplace. Stone Fireplace is actually really nice because um, it's a source of heat and it only throws sparks forward so you have a little bit more space around. Um, yeah, it's looking good. Things are looking pretty great. Let's see. Wow, we have a lot of peat squares over here or chunks. Um, we could put them... I don't know if we have a sto um, a basket for those or not yet. Let's see. Peat something. Peat stack. Yes. Let's put that somewhere. Let's. We can put that outside, maybe? The other thing we can do outside is put a roof over this stuff. Uh, I think that actually might be a good idea. Let's put that in, then. Walls. Water wall. These guys will... Uh, yeah, protect a lot of stuff. One, two, three, four. Wait, one, two, three, four, five, six. Um, put that one here and there. Now, these are meant to grow some mushrooms, so I don't want to put it... I don't know if the, the trees will grow the mushrooms if they're covered. We'll have to check it out, I suppose. Okay, so let's get this uh, roof over this area. 
and see. Okay, good, good. All right, we can even cover part of the road. And that way, if we cover part of the road as well, the, the snow will be prevented from being on the road, which is kind of good if you're having like um, roads between buildings. That's quite handy. In my last colony, I had my food storage quite a ways from the main house because there was a mountain and it was like cold storage, like this room here, when the walls, most of the walls, the floor and the ceiling are made out of mountain, i.e. rock. Um, you get this cold temperature naturally occurring within the room. And um, like right now, we don't have to worry about the jugs so much. So how many mushrooms do we have that are not dried? Okay, we have 391. That seems uh, like a lot. So what I'm going to do is put in more mushroom racks uh, to dry more at a time. So let's get those. Let's see, food, mushroom racks. I'll put in three more uh, so we can get those mushrooms processed. Oh, Deary me, what have I done here? Of course, I, why do I have such a bad problem remembering that I need columns? I don't know what's wrong with me. Anyway, let's see, one, two, three, one, two, three, there. Uh, that should solve the roof problem here, but I have to make a roof instead of uh, just using the one we've had. So that's annoying, but it's okay. We'll, we'll fix it. It will be fine. Let's see, do I have a... Oh, I don't think we have one yet. The, um, like a prioritizing thingy thingy, like, um, oxygen not included has. Okay, tile peat stove. Oh, we still don't have this. What does it require? Tile, clay, bricks, logs, things, stuff. Okay, fine. Uh, let's go, guys. Proceed. Uh, now they're going to clean up this area, hopefully, and hole the things to these peat. Uh, oh, they have many squares. That's excellent. I'm happy about that. Uh, we need to. Uh, looks like add more clay digging. I don't know. The the changes to this game have been amazing. I remember when we needed to like really min-max priorities and stuff like that. And now it's just smooth. Man, that's like butter this game. Fantastic. I'm really having a nice time with this. Um, I like it a lot. So let's do some mountain mining. One two, three. We're going to leave that as a column, I think. This one here. Um, we can do this. One, two, three. One, two, three. And there we can go. Right. Wait, 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 wait. One, two, three. One, two, three. No, that's the wrong one. We need to delete the middle bit here. Let's go ahead and cancel this one. Okay. And then we can mine the rest of this out. Yeah. Or not. Or not. Hold on. One, two, three. One, two, three. Okay, so then we need a, this, a column here. One, two, three, four, five, six there. And okay. One, two, three. And this should be just fine, the rest of this mountain. We'll just mine the rest of it out and see if we can get any more iron or other materials. I think there, is there a silver or gold maybe? I think there might be. What else did we get over here? Oh, nice. We got a sackcloth tunic. Again, we'll build two of these for now. If we get a trader, we might do more. But I don't want them spending a lot of time on clothing other than what the family actually needs. So, okay, this doesn't have quite the reach we might want it to. So it can only go diagonal. One, two instead of three. And it kind of falls off there. But that's okay. Uh, we really just want it to cover the jugs. We want it to cover the peat and uh, make those kind of better. Okay, 12x, let's go, 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 go. I miss the traders, dang it, or the people, traveler people, dang it. All right, it's fine, no worries, no worries. I should, <laughs> I can fill the whole room with beds. <laughs> They'll be cold, but it'll be fine. Right, 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 right. Okay, it's fine. Um, all right, we're filling up on mushrooms, which is great. It is actually great. Look at that, it's nice. Quality getting old, minus two per second is 57%. So hopefully we get some cold soon. But yeah, we definitely need to mushrooms. High priority. Um, these are nine. I want to change. Can I change them all to nine at the same time? Yes. Good. Fantastic. Good, good, good. Mm. But yeah, now we have six mushroom drying racks. That might actually be excessive. Uh, no. How many do we have? We still have 296 mushrooms because they keep collecting them. So I think we need to build more mushroom drying racks. I'll put them in the other room. Uh, they don't actually need to be cold to dry the mushrooms. They just need to be indoors, I think. 
because otherwise they kind of get unhappy about it. But let's build several more racks. Is this too many? <laughs> Is it too many? I don't know. How many do we have here? 11? That's fine. Elva? Yeah, good. It's fine. It's all fine. Okay. And um, I do want to clear the reeds if we have the availability for them. Yeah, some of them can be harvested, uh, which is great. Now, they can't be planted, which is not great, but it's okay. We're going to get a little bit more straw. That's what we use for the roofs, and the name is getting changed, I believe. Uh, the straw, the hay roofs are now going to be made out of straw. So they're going to be called straw roofs, I believe. I, m I mentioned that uh, to the developer because it was like, okay, hay, I got to get hay, which is grass. Straw is different. Straw is made out of these cattails and reeds and stuff. So, yeah, quite a different thing. Did they do our graves? They did one. Okay. And they left the digger here. They left a sickle here. Okay. The, oh, wildcat den. Hello. Is that a wildcat? No, that's a... Uh, what is that? What is that animal there? Hello? It's a kit. It's like a fox. Or is that a wildcat? I don't know. What is this? Is that anything? No, it's a stump of a tree. Oh my god. I, I'm, I'm confusing a stump of a tree for a cat sitting backward. <laughs> it's fine. It's fine. No worries. We do have our chickens here. I wonder if I should build like a fenced area for the chickens to be in. Um, because I don't really want them going out the front door and getting eaten by foxes and stuff. That could be inconvenient slightly. Um, I'm going to go... Wow, these trees are propagating. That never used to happen. Hello? Dang. Okay. All right. Sure. Clear trees. How many days of food? We have 12 days of food. Dang. So that's more than... I think 10 days is... Um, well, it's winter season. It's 10 days. Oh, wow, she got really cold being in here. It's temperature 51. That's not too bad. I, I think it's not bad at all. Anyway, let's... Um, oh, yeah, we need to... Yep, nine. Okay, good. Good, good, good. Feed the mushroom thingies. Get going on these, please. Make them, because I don't want those mushrooms to spoil. I want to have, like, 20 days of food left. That would be great. So we're still... It's fall four. So we still have six days left in fall. Or seven, depending on how you count things. Okay, this is looking good. We need more twine, it looks like. What do we need for twine? Are we? Do I need some grass or something? Let's see what is required. Twine needs straw. Oh, yes. We, well, we only have 700 straw. It should be fine. Not bothered. I'm going to put these graves on low priority. Let's put them on three. Uh, because I don't really need them done until the rest of the stuff is done. It's just something where, like, you're lonely in the winter and you dig your future, you know, relative's grave. That sounds amazing, doesn't it? Okay, only 104 mushrooms left to be dried. And how many do we have dried? 544. Also, I've put in a request to make this interface bigger because I can't read the numbers. And it's even worse because I'm on a laptop and I have a keyboard in front of the laptop. So it's, like, extra far away. Um, but it's okay. Uh, Andrew is working on a thing for that, so don't worry. It will be fixed. Um, it's just like, huh? How many I got now? We have one egg. One cooked egg. Can you imagine, like, keeping a cooked egg? Unless it's, like, hard-boiled or something. Sometimes I do that. I'll, I'll, I'll like, hard-boil, like, a whole bunch in a pot and then have them in a salad or something. Um, but, yeah, keeping, like, a scrambled egg or something in the fridge forever is a little bit weird. I'm not a fan. I don't think that would taste good. I don't even like quiche, unless it's fresh. But fresh quiche is nice. It is really nice. I'm quite happy with fresh quiche. Okay, so... Where are... Oh, there are the pillars. Okay. I almost lost the pillars. It is sunset. Why is nobody staying here? Ah, at my command, the ding has come. Go, coming in. Come on in. All right. But yeah, I don't really want to do the poop hole thing because it feels weird to have my people just naked out in the wilderness and like everybody's watching them poop. It's like, eh. not great. Not a great thing. Let's see. These food baskets are getting filled. These They're going to be tired of dried mushrooms, but I don't really care. I want them to eat. I want them to not die. That's kind of convenient. 
All right, there we go. We are still drawing mushrooms. I should collect more, all that we can. Do we? Are we? Oh, we still have many mushroom jobs out there. So that's uh, good. That's very good. Okay, folks, let's go, go, go. All right, wash, wash, let's go. They're waking up real early. I don't see the time. I don't think we have time. It's just night. But guy has gone up and, oh, you know, he must be a bit like OCD or something. He's like, oh, I had a dream about mess, so I got to go wash my hands. And then he goes back to bed. Dear God. Why is this person, like, just standing and sleeping? I That I don't understand either. That's weird. Maybe they're just weird. I don't know. Oh, I can remove that wall as well. Let's do that. Uh, mine mountains. Mine this. I can mine these three as well and put the wall there. I think that's more efficient in terms of walls. I mean, delete three and place one. Definitely more efficient. Uh, get a little bit more room there around this fire. Of course, we're going to have to extend the non-flammable zone unless we replace this with a stone fire place. Oh, we have five points. Excellent. So let's get the stove, right? I do want to get the fireplace probably next. So we haven't done any hunting yet. I don't know if we actually can. I don't know if we need bows and arrows. I kind of think we do, but I've kind of forgot about it. So tile peat stove heat output 12 F. Is that 12 degrees F or is that 12 units? Heat tiles 192. Is that kind of like a rating for the room size? I actually don't know what this is. I have no clue. Uh, but we're buying it. We have bought it. We're going to replace this fireplace with that, I think. But not a fireplace. This is a cooking fire. Heat output 10F. Tiles 108. I'm guessing that's probably too small for this room. Let's see the temperature here. It is 60 over here. Oh, it's also 60. I expected in the corners it would be cooler, but it is not. Here we have 39. Excellent. And outside it is 49. So this place is doing work, right? It's using the mountain to cool the things because mountains are naturally cold because stone is cold. We are using some flat earth technology here. <laughs> <laughs> We've been watching a lot of like flat earth stuff. I have been highly amused. I love I love the whole like my my favorite thing is the the water flowing uphill. Thousands of miles uphill. I I couldn't understand that until I saw the graphic for that and I was like, whoa. People, please. Please buy brain cells. They have some at IKEA. It's fine. Just go and collect more. Download some from the internet for God's sake. It was scary. It, like, is literally scary. So, anyway. Okay, new baby chicken. Another one. We're going to have to have chicken dinners here shortly. Can we actually dispatch these animals? Slaughter. Yes. No tool required. We can, but I don't know if we actually have... We don't have a butchery table. Maybe that's something we need to buy because our chickens are starting to overrun the place. Uh, right. So, let's go. I think it's way at the top here. Berry bushes, that might be a thing that we would like to plant next year in the spring. Flax retting, I think we need to get this for the flax fibers. I don't know if we have fiber now, do we? Hay, branches, I don't know. I don't know if we, but we made the sackcloth, what was that made out of? Cured flax stems, straw curtain. Okay, that leads into another, f like, clothing thing. Uh, butchery block. Where would that be? Hmm. I know it was a paid thing. Here it is. Two points for that. Um, yeah. Look at this. Log walls are charging us for Lincoln logs. I'm not sure if that's correct or not. Seems a bit sketch, if you ask me. Anyway, um, we'll continue to do life here on the farm here. Again, they're not digging graves. They're not hauling the peat either. I'm a bit surprised because we do have a person who is... Wow, the task list. This is great. I remember when Andrew was working on this thing. He's like, yes, I will make a task list for every task that has been queued in the whole game. And so you see what we have here. Dr. Baby Care 1, but it's at the top. 
gathering 125. Now that would be the mushroom gathering, I bet. And we have 17 cooking items, which I'm a bit mm, surprised with. We only have 18 mushrooms, but 20 are required to do the, the drying. So those are going to be probably eel, eel things. Harvesting 21, building 73. That's, oh yeah, it's all these roof tiles, of course. Mining, hauling, clothes. Now we do have somebody who has hauling quite near the top. Ah, but not very near. And gathering is above that. Okay, that would be it. Right. Okay, well that's fine. Uh, I'd rather have the, uh, the, the mushrooms gathered than the, you know, the peat bricks moved. We don't really care about that. This is so cute, the the uh, adult taking the baby to the poop hole. Like, that's adorable. Um, and if the baby is uh, young, they will have to drop them off. In that case, the baby toddled off to another part of the house. Mm, why did this go funny? Hmm. Okay, let's fix that. I don't like that um, geometry there, so let's move those and delete that one instead. We will just walls and demolish walls. This one, please. And get these two on priority to be done. Good. Why are these not in the baskets? These baskets should be at 10. Okay. And then this, this thing should be at nine. So guys, put the mushrooms in the baskets, please. We ask you politely, nicely to do the thing for us. Um, I also wish, I let's see, I wish to get these done. I want to get these roof tiles done as well. Because um, when winter comes, we don't want this stuff to get snowed on. Oh god, another new baby chicken. Holy fuzzy cats. Right. Idea points, we still have one. This is cool though. Look at this. They they earn idea points by working. So we're going to get an, oh wow, they're more expensive every single point you get. 5,600 to 5,700. Wow. Okay. Butcher block coming out. Let's do that first, um, because we really would like... Now, is this thing messy? I've kind of forgotten. I forgot, like, in RimWorld, you put a butcher block in its own room because there's, like, blood everywhere. It's crazy. So, we want to put this one... Let's put it kind of away from this thing. Is that enough space? Yeah, this is only one tile AOE. We'll go ahead and put in a new stockpile uh, called a flammable blocker around it. And the same with the fire here. We just want to put that flammable blocker there. Uh, this one needs to be deleted pronto because I would love to put in that brand new stove that we got. Um, because that seems cool. I wonder if we can make other things. Like maybe we can make a... Um, does this do flammability? Zero. I am hoping we can replace the cooking fire with this and get all of this space back. Look at this. This is a 3x3 three three area. Nine tiles that we can use for other things. So that's impressive. I always want to have the kitchen stuff very near to the, um, the fridge section of our place, our sort of walk-in fridge, because it's efficient. You can have the people hold stuff automatically. And it works very well. Okay, mushrooms. They're still kind of not getting all of them. By fall, It's fall five right now. So we have five days to collect all these mushrooms. I don't know if they disappear immediately in the winter or what. But yeah, we need to collect more. Because I am bent on having many days of food. We only have 14 right now. I say only, but it is kind of great. So, so far on this tiled peat stove, we're not allowed to make anything. Wow. I think we need to unlock the bros, which is the kind of um, porridge stuff. So we'll 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 unlock that. That need a, needs idea points. Let's see what we can unlock here. We get trees, tinkering bench. I don't even think we need trees because we they're proliferating quite significantly. So let's see. We have a gong place, fertilizer, trading post, manure basket, snare kit. Where's the bros? Hello. Hunt wild animals, add fertilizer, snare, cooked meat, masonry, plant, brick wall, la -de -da -de -da, stuff and things, okay. Oh, we need the clay bowl for this. All right, let's make a clay bowl. And that is where we're going to get the bros from. Right. Yeah, we need the clay bowl. We need to make clay bowls. That is in this thing, the kiln. So let's make a few of those. Oh, we can make five at a time. Let's make 
20? Sure. Yeah, why not? 20 is fine. That seems fine. Oh, we're lacking what? Um, we're lacking the wonderful, beautiful straw. Okay. So what we're going to do is crazy stuff because we're going to do alchemy here, turning hay into straw. Now, <laughs> I'm just amused by this. It's uh, a weird, weird, weird thing. Let's see. This is, is this hay? Yeah, that's grass. Okay. Yeah, it's funny because I remember my mom telling me this story about in Russia, when they trained soldiers, a lot of these soldiers were from villages. You know, they weren't, they didn't even know that left and right were called left and right. So what they would do, they were mostly farmers. So they, they under their little epaulette thingies, they would put hay in one and straw in the other because everybody knew which was which. And then they would march with hay, straw, hay, straw. It's quite convenient. Yeah, so that's how... That I w and whenever I see hay and straw, I always know that. Because, like, uh, having grown up in cities all my life, I'm just like, hey, grassy stuff, it's all the same. It's fine, you know? Grassy stuff is always fine. But anyway, um, I find that amusing. Anyway, it is time to actually finish our episode right now. Um, thank you so very much for joining me. Take care of yourselves and each other, and I'll see you next time.